I'm Tom from California Dad Reviews, and this is a look at the Steam Train Dream Train and Goodnight Goodnight Construction Site book set um, from Sherry Dusky Rinker and Tom Lichtenheld. So these are kind of classic books. Um, they're New York Times bestsellers and um, you know, classic, I'd say, for this generation anyway. So I think these were originally published in the early 2000s. Let me see if we have the title information uh, on the back here. Um, yeah, two, well, mid-2000s, 2013. So fairly new, but I think everybody basically, you know, has this or has used it with their kid. Um, and my son absolutely loves these. We read both of these books every night before bed. Um, and they're really great. They um, walk through for Steam Train, Dream Train, uh, this different, different cars on the train, different things that the animals on those cars are doing. So you have, um, you know, all different really whimsical kinds of illustrations on here. And it walks through each of the different types of cars. And you actually learn a lot as a parent about train cars in doing this. It's not basic things. You get into the auto rack and the flatbed cars and the difference between a well car and a flatbed car. So it's great, very detail-oriented um, for kids that are into trains, but it's also got these really whimsical illustrations. And it brings in the element of animals. So if your kid is a little bit younger um, or they're into any of these different kinds of animals, then this is a great book. And of course, like all good children's books, it ends with going to sleep. Sleep. Um, so you end with good night to the steam train and um, just a really special and kind of whimsical book. The original here uh, that sort of kickstarted this uh, this particular series was good night, good night construction site. And, you know, again, if you have a kid, you know that uh, any construction site is an opportunity to stop and watch for a couple of hours. So this sort of plays on that. And again, um, like Steam Train Dream Train, it's very specific. So it's not just here's a truck. It's going into the, the particular kinds of trucks. Crane truck. Um, you've got, uh, you know, cement mixer. And again, you as a parent might not know all of this, so you start to learn about what each of these kinds of trucks does. So I really like that it gives kids something real to look at. You know, these are, they're not just looking at uh, generic trucks, but they're actually learning the different kinds of trucks they might see on a construction site and what those trucks do. And doing that, you're saying good night to each of the trucks in turn. So each page starts with um, a little bit about the truck and what he did during the day. Um, and then he's going to sleep at the end. Um, and they are all he, so it's been revised a little bit in later books that tie into this series with some female trucks, but just to be aware, all of them in here at this point are male, um, so it is kind of more gendered in that way. Um, but then at the end, everybody's saying goodnight to the whole construction site, and again, it ends with a goodnight uh, kind of message. So these are great bedtime books to read. And again, it's really nice how it ties into real construction equipment, because then they can start to recognize when they see a construction site. In reality, well, you know, that's an excavator um, versus, you know, another one might be a cement mixer or a bulldozer uh, or a dump truck. And again, you know, really nice illustrations. And you as a parent can start to actually learn about some of these things as well. Um, another thing that I like about this one is that it, it has these um, kind of sounds built into it. So um, these read like a you know stage direction in a script or something. Um, so you can make the crunch sound. You can make for each truck. There's a particular sound that gets tied into it. So he yawns. Um, you can actually make the yawn if you want to. And I think that just adds a little extra element to it because it's not just the words. There's some actions, and your kid might start to follow along with those uh, with you. So these are a great set. You can get them as a box set. Um, you can get this on Amazon. You can see from the amount of wear around the edges that these get used all the time, but they've held up really well for over a year. So that's Steam Train Dream Train and Good Night, Good Night Construction Site. If you found this helpful in any way, please subscribe to my channel. It really helps.